zero drop frames versus uh, fifteen percent drop frames. Time to go get an AMD. Yeah, the, I, I don't tip. think the current ones that are out are the ones that people really should be buying. No, really. But they're great for the price point, but I don't think they're really good for consumers. Hmm. No, no consumer really needs the eight sixteen. A prosumer. A like prosumer? I've yeah, never that, heard of that's, that before. That's the new thing for people who are semi-pro. Yeah. I know what you're doing, making money off of. Well, obviously, you're not making money off yeah, of yeah. it. Anymore, but I mean, the people who stream and do that sort of thing uh, for some money, that's where I think it's worth it because a $500 uh, CPU is not something that a normal person really needs to be paying. All right. So you kept that. Yep, yeah, that's completely keep the wall. Are you kidding me? That's wonderful. Yeah, get that crane in there. Make it so he doesn't want to attack him. Or make him have to just... Do I crane? Yeah. Or... Do I poison her? No, if I poison her, he'll just make a... He's just flying over. I mean, who cares? Yeah, or just a crane. Well, I was going to say, he can make a... Thing in the yeah! Yeah! Oh yeah, he'll be making his own servo. servo and then I can't attack him with the yeah. poison. Okay. So no one with that icon was in your pool, so you're not playing with someone in your pool. Makes sense. He's running low on mana. Uh, yes. No lands. That's good. Peep out will block all day long. If you want to do that. Peep out or double cog workers. I, I don't know what you're in a cog workers for. Like if you if you had, if I had a bastion inventor. Yeah, if you had bastion inventor, if you had uh, so it's touch where you want something mm -hmm. to target, you would still peep out better than you get a five five flyer. That it is. It's clicks too that. fast. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, quick smash rival. Gosh dang it. <sighs> Still going with beef out, though. No reason for him to do anything with that. You can go with them. Yeah, just those two. Yeah. He's gonna shoot one down. I'd rather have him use the two there. Do you May the, be the problem with this deck because I don't have beef. Do you leave in dust his uh, goggles so they lose the tap ability? Yes, I should have done that earlier. I guess he would have. Yeah, oh. he, he would have done it in response. I should have done it right now. Yes, you should have. Right then, that's what I was trying to tell you. <laughs> he can take out my poisoner. Yeah.
Holy cow, so many lands. That's good. Fowl or not because it's already a threat. Make another threat. No, I think I prefer the flyer. Because so. Peafowl is not that big of a threat. It's not, but putting your eggs in one basket you know, by itself and still getting two damage every turn if you also have a five five. Especially on like the Cuddle Puzzle Nut that's not doing anything right now. You can I still like the flyer better. Okay. Yeah, I'll get it back if he kills it too. Bounce it back to your hand. Still getting it back now. Yeah. Does he have a response? Counterspell? He didn't equip the goggles, so we might have like a leave in the dust. Yeah. Disallow. No? Can I wait for you to attack with it? Sure. Why did he take five? Hey, you you misplayed your leave of the dust. I did. I did. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he was keeping it open in case I had counter spells or something. Yeah. Probably. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. He's already got two energy. That's not good. Needs to get to eight. Start having two attacks. Flyer is good. First time I've ever seen a lightning render play. Yeah. Aether Sphere Harvester. Oh gosh. That's a good target for Trophy Mage. <laughs> yes. Yes it is. <laughs> Dominate your P foul. I like them both. Yeah, uh, question is what, which one do you want more? That cruel finale gets rid of Lightning Runner right now while he's tapped out. Lightning Runner's not the problem, though. The Aether Sphere Harvester is. Also takes care of that if he tries to. No, it does not, because your guy. They're both 2 4s. 2 3 and 2 4. So I think I put the Inventor on top so I can get that. I should have tapped something so I could have got that player. Yeah. Oh well. So you're taking. <clears throat> no. 
No, he has eight. Yep, I told you. Lightning runner. Lightning runner is not the problem. Oh, no. He didn't attack. Me. Really? Let me take that off. He's got two cards in hand, only two mana. The question is. Oh, we only needed six, but. Is holding the Curl Finality better? Can you do anything right now if you did Curl Finality? No. This is a response. He should crew the Harvester. Yeah. But it's not like he doesn't have plenty of other things. But to getting another attack step doesn't do anything for him. No, it doesn't right now. So just save the finality. Pass it on back. I'm going to let him attack in. Yeah. Then I can block the harvester. That's where you should have called finality. It's fine. Think so? Yeah. No, I don't care. Do not care. Doesn't have trample. Yay! Cool. <laughs> Another circle. How do I get through, though? I don't know. How, you have to get rid of the harvester before you can start attacking again. And I don't. I mean, I can. There's nothing I can do. Draw another. Right. Oh, okay, here he this comes. Is what he there he comes. <clears throat> you wanted him to swing with the harvester. Oh, perfect. Double block. I'm gonna throw everything at it. Yeah. Oh, all three. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, it can't even block artifacts. It's okay. He's got scroll finality. Probably what he probably was hoping he didn't have. We'll see if he's got a pumper, like a built to smash. Attacking in there just bringing the lifelink. Nice. You don't get the scry, but it's fine. That's fine. That's what you was holding you back. Yep. Great. The question is whether the rest of your board is enough to hold him back. He doesn't get the lifelink. The one lifelink. I guess that doesn't really matter. But the thing is, like, I'm not sure it's going to hold back the lightning runner anymore. If you if you were swinging with the uh, P foul, I think you just is swinging with the Drake. That shouldn't affect too much. Yeah, it does. It's taking two of your. Well, I attack Drake and P foul. That puts him on a one turn clock. That's true. But next turn, I can swing in for lots of damage. I think the longer I wait, the worse it gets. Yeah. He's coming in for the counter here. <clears throat> okay. Doesn't have haste. Yep. Doesn't do a whole lot. Can cruise dragster. He's got to swing in. Here. Question is, can you live through it? I mean, right now, Bastion Inventor is the only thing that favorably blocks the lightning runner. So it only gets one extra attack. Uh, he just wants the two cards. It's good. Unless you kill it. Do I block? Do you trade one of your few blockers? Or no, do I can you block with the 05. Oh, just block? Yes. Yeah. Yes, I think you block. I think he just wants the two cards. Do I let him have it? Or do I... That's the question. 
kill it off. I don't think you can let him have a card advantage, but he's already got really board advantage, especially because I mean, if he draws a flyer or a pump for his flyers, he can kill one of your flyers. I agree. <sighs> Got plenty of energy for that. Now you can swing in and then untap your P-Foul. Oh, it doesn't have haste. Well, I mean, not this turn. Yeah. Uh, do I go for... Do I go with just the P-Foul? Why? Because if I go with the Hintel and Drake, he can... Trade it. You can double lock, you're right. Sweet. Interesting that I do that when he doesn't have to yet. Annoying. That makes Lightning Runner a real pain in the butt. What's that for? It allows them to block your P foul. And they just bounce off each other. Well, you can do that with the decoction mod module and whatever. Now I can just tap it down and go for lethal. Yeah, that's true. Maybe he didn't realize that. Tap, Ether Swoop. Yes, that's what I want. Maybe he wants me to do this. What's he got? Uh, return to my hand type card. Okay, Excuse that's me. just a... But he had eight mana, or er, energy for the longest time. Um, ice over. Ice over would be fine. Select from confession is not good here. Neither is leaving dust. Do you ice over over the leaving dust? I mean, we did do a good job with leaving yeah, dust. Yeah, uh, I, I think leaving the dust is very important. But who do you take out? Cogwell Component? Two, two drop for two drop? Or do you need to get rid of uh, another spell? I don't think the plunderer does much for us here. Except be a flyer. Mm. Which is what won us the game. I think yeah. Above and yeah. Oh, wait. Oh. I was going to bring in the big 7 5. Maybe not. Was that game one? Yeah. Good crap. we got to play faster. You're only 16 minutes. Yeah, so is he. Whoa, double mulligan. Oof. Well, maybe you won't have to play fast. Be fun, but pal. Tom remixed. Next turn, unless I draw a swamp, then I'll do both 
ethers. <clears throat> Block the swooper. He just wanted to get the servo. Because he knew he couldn't kill it. Hope he doesn't pyro helix here. Yeah. Mori, or do I eat scry? Three attacker for eight turns. Yeah. Or four, one. Well, probably not eight turns because you're gonna be getting some servos. Beautiful. Touch that servo. Wasn't that? Or servo. Servo, because you want to scry, don't you? Probably. You want the energy. Probably. Puzzle knot it is not an implement. Okay. Yeah. Because the implements are fine when they go to the graveyard. Mm -hmm. Right. It's almost a bonus. Sure. Leaving the dust. Wow. Still on that aggro plan. I think I like yeah. the Drake. Mm -hmm. Drake blocks the other Drake. And the swooper. Yeah, that'll hold him back good. Not playing yet. Well, I'm not attacking. Why not? I guess I could attack with the 5-5. Yeah. Five, five. And you can leave in dust if he does something weird. Yep. That pre, yeah. Let's see what you can get. Cool. Very nice. Very nice. Yeah, I don't think you can attack with anything else right now. Uh, besides maybe the Drake, but that's still a no. Nice. We'll play the foul. Yeah. He already got rid of his energy from his harvester? Mm hmm You got this. I think you can start attacking with uh, more I just told him to leave in dust for anything. Probably even do the... Oh, you didn't make the P-Fell flying. It's fine. I don't do any You're more You're just going to do straight? He kept it on top, so that's probably not good. Just leave, yeah. Maybe leave and dust mana up. If there's nothing else you could bring back here to touch. Mm. If he tries to take care of it. Good thought. 
Dare Circle. That's what he left on top. It's a, it's a blocker. It's also f puts me on a two turn clock, and I can't um, attack into it. It's a five six. That's what he meant by blocker. Yeah, yeah gotcha. <laughs> That's a good draw. I believe you can attack him with the ear. But he's got the harvester. Then you can attack him with your poison. Well, I can it. Yeah, I can attack him with the poison. Of course, the poisoner makes him have to pay the six for the gear seeker if he's going to attack. You want him to attack. You want to ice over. What if I? Yeah. What if I bounce? Aether harvester. Here you go. How about this? I enter attack phase. He's gonna crew the harvester with the automaton. Yeah. Yeah. I bounce the harvester. Mm -hmm. I swing in with everybody. He'll block the Tezzeret's touch. With the six five. He'll block the P foul with the swooper. The Drake with the Drake for most damage. One two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten damage. And you lose one flyer and the Tezzeret's touch. And you'll they'll swing back for five, six, seven, eight. No. Seven. Cause what is he losing? He's losing a well, Drake. Well he could he could keep he'll keep that. Yeah, um, Drake he'll and the Swooper. That. He'll lose. Well, he could make it so that doesn't happen. Block he could, but then he would take an extra damage. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He would take an extra one damage if he does that. But that would be fine for him. It puts him to one. I can make a servo with that. Mm -hmm. Make sure you make the P file flying if you do it. Oh, but I don't want to do. I don't want to make him flying. Oh, you can't. Because I need the you need mana. mana. I don't think it matters because they all have flying. Except for the gear sticker, but it's going to go that's on gonna the block right. yeah. Okay, um, I think that's a plan. <clears throat> that is a plan. <laughs> <laughs> Just straight up swing in with everything, see what he does. He has no cards in hand. So At most, he can do five, six, seven, eight damage to me. Yeah, yeah. But if he does, then he's going to take lethal. So. Now he's doing the math. <laughs> yeah, the only blocks there, he's taking 11. Sorry, he's taking 13. He's going to block at least 3. No, no, is it 13? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. He has to block the more. 10, 11, 12. 14, so yeah, he's got a he's got a block. The Tizzard Station, he's also got a block at least two more damage, so the more would be the easiest one. Mm-hmm. You saw that. <laughs> oh, he didn't crew the yeah, harvester. He didn't crew the harvester. You're you're golden. You can return the gear seat reserve if you wanted to. <laughs> that would keep your Tezzeret touch alive. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, and it eats it. Oh, that's wonderful. Mm hmm. So you take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then you return the gear serpent back to his hand. But he can still do one, two, three, four, five. And gain three. No, he doesn't have any energy. He has no energy. Yeah. Yeah. And he, he can't.
can attack him like that, yeah, because he won't be able to do enough damage. That should be game. Whew. Unless he drew something sick. That is a good draw. That is a good draw. Gives him the, the lifelink. That means he can't play the serpent. I don't know if it's going to be enough. Then just get pack, attack the five to send a message. Just the three with lifelink. <laughs> oh, good. Because <laughs> uh, <laughs> you had to be him there if he, if he let it if yeah, slide. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> good. Yeah, see, the, the questionable deck did perfectly. Yep. <laughs> Man. That did not feel good, though. No, it didn't. That was a tight game. Hmm. Okay. 